Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to another Day in the Life video. This week, I have everything that we need to do this week on my to-do list right here on the screen right now. But the more interesting things that are happening this week are we should be hearing back about potential interviews for our sites for clinical experience number three. So I'm hoping for that, as well as I believe we're having a class or two with some of the PTA students at a local college. So it will be fun to get to interact with them and talk with some of our future colleagues as a whole. So I'm excited for that, but the rest of today is really just going to be knocking out a little bit of the items on my to-do list, as well as enjoying some time with my girlfriend's family. So it will be pretty laid back overall, but it should be a good day. Well, we are just heading back to our apartment from work. Overall, it was very productive. I got pretty much everything that I need done that I can get done right now. So I'm very happy that I can just kind of spend the rest of the day doing whatever I need, which will probably be a little bit of cleaning the apartment and trying to get ahead on some other things logistically. So that's kind of the plan for the rest of the day. But yesterday we had a good time. We also got a couple of things done in between just hanging out and having fun with family so it was a good time overall but I'm just going to head back to my apartment and grab myself some lunch. Well, we're all done with class for today. It ended up being a very good day overall, but going back to yesterday, it ended up also being very fun because my girlfriend and I decided since we had a good chunk of time, we went out for a hike, we went out to dinner, and just spent the rest of the evening doing some organization in our apartment because we're trying to clean things out, create more space for ourselves, so we were very productive overall. But then this morning we had a class with PTA students from a local school. So it's interesting getting to talk with them, see their perspectives and just kind of understand a bit more of what's within their curriculum as a whole. So that was great. And then we in the afternoon had a lecture on endocrine disorders and medical screening for medical conditions. But now that I am home, I'm feeling pretty tired. I think I'm going to do just a few chores and then I might take a quick nap before I start thinking about the rest of the week. I think what I want to do is probably doing some studying through Picmonic, which if you guys want, it's in every video. There's that 20% off discount code. It's been very useful. I've been actually, as we're going through some of these classes and some of the Picmonics I've done already, I've been noticing that I was like, oh, you know, we're talking about this. This is something that's seen in Graves' disease because I know that hyperthyroidism is part of that presentation and the bulging eyes. So definitely helping with my retention as a whole and being ahead of the curve. So I'm going to take some time to get back on that tonight, but it should be a pretty relaxing night otherwise. Well, class is all done for the day and it went really well. We, in the morning, we're just talking about frailty and sarcopenia and talking about just getting older, some of those changes, some things that we can do in order to either minimize or reverse those changes as best as we can. So it was some really good conversation then in medical conditions. And then when we got to the afternoon, we went over some cases for some neurological type conditions 
within our applied exercise science kind of mindset and thought through our exercise prescriptions, some of the referrals that we might do, all things like that. And one of the fun things was that one of the people who was helping out with that session was actually the supervisor of the physical therapist that I had over at my clinical that I just finished. So I got to catch up with her and just see how my clinical instructors were doing and say hi. So it was a really fun way to end the afternoon. But now the only thing that I have for the rest of tonight is heading off to work. And I think I'm mainly going to work on catching up on a lot of things with my research, just making sure that I get all the logistics put in, make sure the tracking sheets are up to date, and contacting any of the new people that we have coming into the trial that we're starting this week, since I will be doing that tomorrow morning. So that's going to kind of be the main focus of tonight. And then if I have time, maybe doing a little bit of Picmonic, doing some MPTE prep just to sprinkle it in wherever I can. I got a lot of research work done today, both in the morning and this afternoon getting a few more intakes and just making sure that we are keeping the ball rolling because we're doing really well. We're finding we're actually recruiting a good amount of people to the point where we're actually much further ahead than we were expecting in terms of recruitment. So we're very content with that. But now that I'm home and done with classes for the day where we talked about in healthcare delivery, kind of our innovation project, that we have coming up that will be kind of what we're working on in our healthcare delivery class coming up in the future weeks, but we do have our final exam for that next week. So that's kind of going to be the main focus there. But the rest of the evening, I think I'm going to spend some time organizing the apartment, knocking out some items in regards to preparing for those exams. I know that we're having a discussion tomorrow in Applied Exercise Science about what's going to be on the exam and what questions we have. So I want to make sure to go through the study guide for that before class and then start looking at our healthcare delivery items just to make sure we're feeling nice and confident going into it next week. Well, I'm all done with class for the day and heading off to work for the next five hours. But earlier today, we had medical conditions where we went over cardiopulmonary conditions across the lifespan and just how things change within the body. And then in the afternoon, we had applied exercise science where we were just doing a bit of exam review, going over the cases that we had already finished as well as the lab that we had recently. So it was a good day, but now we're heading off to work where since I got a lot of work done with research last time I was at the gym, I'm going to focus more on doing some exam prep. So that's going to be my main focus for tonight. That brings us to the end of this week and this video as a whole. This week was full of a lot of fun things such as getting to interact with the PTA students in the beginning of the week, getting to go on a fun adventure with my girlfriend over the weekend, and then just a fun week of classes with lots of useful information getting us ready for finals, which will be starting next week. So if you want to see that, make sure to look out for that video next week. If you enjoyed this one, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe as well. Thank you all so much for watching. This has been KBDPT. I'll see you all in the next video.